Hey guys, welcome or welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to give you my honest opinions and reviews on the Shakti mat. Now this video is not sponsored in any way, however they did gift me the Shakti mat themselves and let me develop my own opinions on the mat and share it with you guys, so that's what I'm here to do. First of all, I do have a discount code for you guys if you want to purchase a Shakti mat for yourself. I will leave it on the screen for you guys here. I personally had been seeing these Shakti mats show up all over Facebook. I don't know about you guys, but it's all over my Facebook ads and it looked really interesting to me and I really wanted to give it a go. So I reached out to Shakti and they sent me one of these out and I have been giving this bad boy a go. There are little discs with a bunch of spikes on them, which I know sounds uncomfortable. If you haven't tried an acupressure mat before, highly recommend. The first thing that I want to mention about the Shakti mat and their brand before I jump into what I love about the Shakti mat and how I use it and all of those things. I just want to mention that every single time a person purchases a Shakti mat, Shakti actually donates to charity a percentage of your purchase and the customer actually gets to pick which charity it gets donated to. I think that is an amazing thing that they're doing by actually implementing that in their brand. Kudos to you Shakti for doing that. So I just wanted to mention that before I jump into my review. First off, I want to talk about my first experience with the Shakti mat. I didn't have, I didn't know what to expect when I tried it for the first time because it looks super painful and I just didn't, I didn't know what to expect. My first experience with the Shakti mat, I said to myself, I want to just get through 20 minutes. As long as I can do 20 minutes, I'll be happy with that. And I tried it on the ground for the first time. I don't, I don't know why this happened or like how it happened, but I laid down on the Shakti mat on the floor and within like five to 10 minutes, I was like out, I fell asleep. And for those of you who know me, I don't fall asleep easily. That's a huge thing that I have dealt with in my life is like insomnia and just not being able to sleep properly. I, it takes me a long time to fall asleep. So the fact that I was laying on this mat that's like full of like spikes digging into my back and I fell asleep within five minutes was amazing to me. And I went past the 20 minute time frame because I fell asleep and I woke up 40 minutes later in the light lit room because <laughs> I wasn't planning on sleeping on it. I was like, I just fell asleep. <laughs> and Luke was like, yeah, you did. So instantly within the first use, the Shakti mat had improved my sleep, just going to sleep in general. But over the course of time, it's improved my quality of sleep. Now in saying that, I have a snoring husband and a baby. So I struggle to get even two hours of sleep throughout the night because of the combination of that. But the quality of my sleep when I do sleep is better, if that makes sense. As to whether I found it challenging, I would personally say no. I know that some people do and not everyone has the same experience, but for me personally, when I use the Shakti mat, I don't find it that challenging. When you initially lay down on the Shakti mat or stand on it, depending on how you're using it, your body does want to kind of pull away a little bit because it, it can be a little bit painful, but I found that very quickly that changed and it was just comfortable. Like I said, not everyone has the same experience, but this is just personally my experience. There's something called the peel on and the peel off. So laying down on your Shakti mat is the peel on and then obviously getting up is peeling it off. And I personally found that the peel off was harder than the peel on. Laying down on it, I don't feel anything other than nice feelings, which is totally not what I was expecting, but that's just, that's just how I feel, like, feel about it. Peeling off, on the other hand, it's not painful when you're laying on it, but as you peel off, for me personally, it's a little bit more painful than the rest of the experience. But once again, that's just my personal experience. But as soon as you're off the mat, there's no pain. <laughs> but I have a photo on my phone somewhere of my skin after using the Shakti mat, and I'll insert it on the screen for you guys to see what it looks like. I usually use my mat for the first time I used it on the floor and then I found out you meant to use it like on a bed or something like that so that it's easier for your for the mat to contour to your body. So I've used it on, my, on the bed a couple of times and it does make it easier for the mat to contour to your body. I don't mind using it on the floor though, but I use it on the bed and on the floor, but mostly, surprisingly, I use it in my 
gaming chair, <laughs> my computer chair. I lay it down on the back of my computer chair. I can lay on it like that and it contours to my body nicely and I can watch my computer, like watch a video or something on my computer while I'm laying on my Shakti mat. It's, it just like fits into that portion of my life. I don't have to go out of my way to use it, if that makes sense. I mostly use the mat on my back. However, I have used it on my feet and I do like it on my feet, but I'm not at the point where I can take my socks off yet. You have to kind of build yourself up to that. I've used it with my socks off a couple of times, but I'm just not at the point where it just hurts a little bit too much to use on my feet without socks. With really thin socks on, it's perfect and I really, really enjoy it. I'm working up to being able to not use socks at all. My number one tip for you guys, if you do want to purchase a Shakti mat and try it for yourself, is set a goal of how long you want to use it for, especially that first time, just so you get a really good idea of what it's gonna do to your body. I set myself, like I said, a 20 minute time frame, but I fell asleep and did body. But, <laughs> but set yourself a goal so that you have something to work towards. And also set yourself a goal of setting time aside each day to use the Shakti mat. I said to myself that I wanted to use it for 20 minutes every single day because as a mother you don't get any time to yourself you just like constantly have someone on you and if I'm making myself do 20 minutes a day with the Shakti mat it honestly is amazing for my mental health. The days that I don't use the Shakti mat I can definitely tell the difference in my mental health and my sleep actually so I really need to be making time for myself which I don't always do but I need to continue to do it because it honestly changes how I feel the day, my anxiety, my sleep and just giving yourself 20 minutes to just work on you to lay on this mat and just do nothing is amazing. I mostly try and lay on the mat once the girls are in bed so that way I have the best chance of not being interrupted when I'm laying down on it and it's a really good way for me to unwind at the end of the day and go okay this is me time now I've done everything for everyone else for the day this is 20 minutes for me. What kind of triggered me to try the Shakti mat like I said was motherhood gets really busy and I wasn't making any time for myself I figured this would be a good way to just set 20 minutes aside for myself each day to just work on me. And also, like I said, the ads were really interesting and I liked the benefits that a lot of people get from the Shakti mat that I have experienced already, like I said, lessened anxiety, better sleep, just like setting more time for me. They're the reasons that I really wanted to get my hands on one. I would highly recommend if you have trouble sleeping or you have anxiety or you even have trouble setting time aside for yourself as a mother or just as a person to purchase a Shakti mat and try it for yourself. You've got nothing to lose but everything to gain in my personal opinion. This is just how it worked for me. For the longest time I saw these mats show up, showing up in my Facebook <laughs> ads and I was just like, what is this mat? Because it's intriguing, it looks like it's painful and to some it is, but if you can get past that you know, few minutes of your body resisting. It's the most wonderful, like warm, tingly, kind of like, kind of like um, when you like, I don't know how to explain it. It's feel good hormones that it releases in your body. And it's just like a warm, tingly feeling physically and also for me mentally. So highly recommend giving it a go if you haven't already. If you do purchase a Shakti mat and you give it a go yourself, let me know how you like it, whether you love it, whether it had the same benefits for you. Don't forget to use my discount code, which I will leave in the description box down below. And thank you so much for watching this video. Give it a thumbs up if you liked it, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye.